In this video today, I'm going to be testing out Serato stems on a $4,000 laptop. So the specs on this laptop are, it's on macOS Monterey version 12.6.1. It's a MacBook Pro 16-inch 2021. The chip is an Apple M1 Max and the memory is 32 gigabytes. And the storage on this MacBook is one terabyte. So as you can tell, this is a very powerful MacBook. So in this video, I'm gonna try and see if it's actually worth spending this money to run Serato Stems. So as you can see, we've got Serato 3.0 on the screen right now, and my laptop is plugged into a DJM S9 mixer and one Rain 12. What we're gonna do is test out a few things with Serato Stems to see how this laptop performs. Obviously, it's a $4,000 laptop, so you're expecting to have the best quality. So the first thing we're gonna do is just load a track on the left-hand side. And we're gonna press play on this track and all we're gonna do is remove the instrumental and just have the acapella playing and we're gonna see how the laptop performs. So I'm gonna take out the instrumental now and just have the acapella playing. I don't know what you heard good about me. But if you're scared, get that mother out of me. No kind of that, no perms you can't see. And as you can see right there, the acapella literally instantly started working. On some other MacBooks, it does take a while for the stems to load, but on this MacBook, you can see that it works straight away. So what we're gonna do next is just have the instrumental playing. So we're gonna just press this button here, and we're just gonna press play and to see how the laptop performs. As you can see on the top right hand corner, the CPU is still pretty low. So what I'm gonna do now is just bring the vocal back in. And I'm gonna use some of the effects as well. So as you can see, everything is working flawlessly. Obviously, it's got 32 gigabytes of RAM. It's got Apple's M1 Max Pro chip in. So you're expecting to have the best quality when you're running Serato Stems. So what we're gonna do next is let's just try another track. So let's put this track on the right-hand side and we're just gonna press play. We're gonna take out the acapella. We're gonna take out the instrumental and just see how the laptop performs. So sexy. So we're gonna take out the vocals now. As you can see, it was completely instant. Let's put the vocal back in. And let's take out the drums. Take out the bass. And as you can see, everything is just working flawlessly on this laptop. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna just have two tracks playing. We're gonna try and blend two tracks together and see how the laptop performs. So we're gonna have Sexy Love on the left-hand side and we're gonna have Big Popper on the right-hand side. Let's just match up these two BPMs. So let's pull this down to about 96. And let's just sync this one up. So on the left-hand side, we're gonna have just the vocal playing. And on the right hand side, we're just gonna have the instrumental playing. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna play both of the tracks at the same time and then we're gonna hear them blend together and we're gonna see how the laptop performs. We're gonna keep an eye on the CPU in the top right hand corner to make sure that it doesn't go over. And yeah, let's see how this performs. My sexy CPU is still very low, people. Absolutely no lag on the screen. Just one touch, and I erupt like a volcano and cover her with my love. Baby girl, you make me say. So that was me testing out Serato stems on a $4,000 MacBook Pro. Do you really need to be spending this amount of money to run Serato Stems? Check this video out here where I test out Serato Stems on an $84 laptop. I'll catch you in the next one.